East Cobb versus West Cobb. First off, where is Cobb County? Cobb County is located in the Northwest Atlanta area, straight up 75 from the city. It is made up of 766,000 people. So in East Cobb, you've got parts of Roswell, parts of Kennesaw, parts of Marietta, parts of Vinings and Smyrna. And then West Cobb is made up of Powder Springs, Mableton, a majority of Kennesaw and Ackworth as well. Shops and dining, East Cobb, you have the avenues. You have high-end stores like Lululemon and Banana Republic and High Country Outfitters. And dining options, you got Drift, Oyster House, along with Stockyard Burgers. Then you have Merchants Walk with the flagship Whole Foods, and they also have a cinema. Now, West Cobb, you've got the West Cobb Avenues with places like Chico's, American Eagle, Ted's Montana Grill. You've got places off Barrett Parkway like Costco, REI, Best Buy. Then you have the Kennesaw Marketplace that has another flag store. Yes, they have a Whole Foods too. Then we have Truist Battery Park, which has awesome places like Antico's Pizza. You have Rocky Patel's Burn Cigar Lounge. You also have Wahlburgers, and then Terrapin Tap House and the Atlanta Braves, folks, come on. Let's talk school system. East Cobb had an article that came out from US News, said six of their high schools were ranked in the top 40% in the nation. Number two in the state of Georgia was Walton High alone. Let's talk West Cobb. So if you go to niche.com, don't let West Cobb fool you here. Niche.com rated Alatoona High an A+, Harrison an A+, and North Cobb an A-. minus. So. I really think it's a win-win. My personal favorite, activities and recreation. In West Cobb, we have Kennesaw Mountain National Battlefield, Burnt Hickory Running Trails, the Silver Comet Trail, Alatoona Creek Bike Park, and then Alatoona Lake, which is great for wake surfing, skiing, paddleboarding, kayaking, and fishing. East Cobb activities and recreation. You got places like Chattahoochee Nature Trails. You've got Soap Creek, which is actually a national park that you can hike and bike. And then you've got West Palisades, which is just west of the Chattahoochee River that is also part of the national park system. Let's talk pricing and affordability. So Redfin said that East Cobb was sitting at median price point of $495,000 and West Cobb was $385,000. That's nearly a $100,000 difference. And then if you go to costofliving.org, it actually says the cost of living is more in West Cobb and cost of living is a bunch of other stats, not just housing cost. All right. All the data is in East Cobb versus West Cobb. There wasn't a ton of variability there, but leave us a comment below what you think why East Cobb is better than West Cobb or why West Cobb is better than East Cobb. We want to know your thoughts. We want to know your opinion. Leave us a comment. And if you need anything in the Northwest Atlanta area, my name is Greg Goad with Goad Home Partners at Real Broker. Peace.